Are you a buyer getting frustrated with our current real estate market, tired of making insanely high offers in a bidding war and still losing out? Are you over writing love letters to the seller hoping they will pick you over another buyer? If so, this is for you. First off, know that you're not alone. With record in low inventory and high demand, it's hard to be a buyer in this market. I'm Heather Vandermod and this is Will Gregg. We have some options you may want to consider if you're tired of bidding wars. What we're learning in this market is that oftentimes buyers are now having to change direction and many are deciding to uh, purchase a, a vacant lot to build and others are choosing older homes to renovate. And this is where I have to brag about Will Gregg. He is awesome. He had boots on the ground hunting potential properties and doing virtual showings for clients. He would look at almost anything and everything if it fit their location and what the buyer was looking for. Finally, there she was, a property that likely most agents and buyers would have forgotten about or passed through. However, Will saw the potential and I was shocked when he picked this house. Why don't you share why you shared that house? Okay, um, head of this house was both equal parts potential and credential. Uh, this house's location is the, is the credential because it's so close to the ocean front. It's semi ocean front. Um, the lot is huge. Three so, lots. Yep, it's, it's, it's you know, three lots away from walking, toes into the water. Um, the other thing is the potential for this house. This home has not fully realized its footprint because of the lot size. When they built this house, they weren't maxing out the lot, maximizing the lot value the way we are now. Correct. Well, because this market demands that buyers be a little more flexible, this is what we have to offer them. It's a great property with plenty of potential and the views are incredible. And we work with very talented builders and designers who specialize in maximizing the highest and best use and try to make it as easy as possible for our clients. Today we're going behind the scenes, and I'm very excited about this, with a local builder, Matt Neal, with Neal Contracting, to see how we can best maximize this property to help give our clients a fresh start to an older Hope. So it's going to be pretty exciting, exciting to see what he comes up with. Yeah, let's get. Fun. Yeah, let's get taking a look. Exactly, that's the renovation. What do you think? How did it go? Uh, this is everything that I think they were looking for. Me the, too. the potential, everything he lined up is uh, with the intention of creating more income and more value to the home. And this is this is ideal for the Yeah, the, the rec room, the, the extra masters. Um, so getting more bedrooms in there gives you more income. And I, I love what he did with the outdoor kitchen area. Yeah, yeah. That was a great idea. That was brilliant because buyers are demanding more and more outdoor living space now. They are. This house will accommodate. And they want to rent that. So it's yes. all about the rental potential. So the whole point of this show, in case you haven't got it yet, is that there are other options. With an experienced agent on your side who knows how to maximize a property and who will actually weed through the properties like Will does, um, will open you up to a world of possibilities even in this current bidding war market. So get out there, get a good agent, get somebody that will hustle for you, negotiate for you, and good luck. Put me to work.